Today, let's transform your Canva design into a stunning digital greeting card using eCardWidget.com, just like this design. You can share it via email, text message, you name it. So let's get started. First, we're gonna go over to canva.com. And I found a template here that looks great. I'm gonna go ahead and hit customize this template. Looks good. I'm gonna hit share. And then we're gonna go ahead and download this. That way we can upload it uh, as an e-card. Over here at ecardwidget.com, we can click new e-card. I've already created my account. Um, we're gonna go ahead and skip past these free templates that are included. And we're just gonna upload our own design from Canva. Pick our card. There we go, we've got it selected. You can see the card is pretty uh, simple here. So let's go ahead and add a backdrop. So I can just search the free stock photos. Got that selected. Let's add, let's change that lining from gold to another color. There we go, that looks good. And we can also add confetti. We could upload audio and video. Uh, let's skip those for now. We'll just do the confetti. And I can also change the text on the card. So I'm just gonna put in happy birthday. Um, I can even change the, uh, the email subject. There's lots of options. You can also brand this for your business or whatever else. Yeah, you can add your logo and social medias and stuff on the uh, card layout page. We're gonna go ahead and give it a name and that will display in the form. And that's it. So we've got it, you can see in the preview, We've got the confetti, we've got the personal message and stuff here. So let's hit save. Awesome. So we now have our first greeting card that can be sent out by uh, you or any of your friends or customers. And uh, you can even just get this uh, public page link that you can just share uh, and, and your friends and whoever else in your audience can click, uh, choose a design. They can fill out the form, do that real quick add recipients. You can actually add multiple recipients or upload your address book or spreadsheet. And I'm gonna go ahead and include a personal message. First, I wanna preview it to make sure it looks good. And I can see my personal message, looks great. Okay, and I can also get notified later by checking that off. I can schedule it later for like say the birthday and um, you can also real quick, you can share these via social media, but we're going to do email for this example. And one other thing uh, I'd like to mention is you can also charge for them. So this could be uh, another uh, revenue stream as a creator or as a nonprofit or business. Um, you could charge for your card. So that's another idea. So go ahead and hit send email. There you go. So it's been sent and it's that easy. Um, you can go ahead and get signed up over at ecardwidget.com. Uh, it's, it's free to sign up and, uh, you know, feel free to reach out if you have any questions. Thanks.